four keys to Craigslist. The first, searchtempest.com. That's the Mac Daddy of all search engines for Craigslist. What it allows you to do is it allows you to search across multiple cities and multiple categories at once. So if you put in your, you know, let's say you're looking for houses or apartments all across the country, you can go to Search Tempest and put in 15 cities, check the, the, the relevant, you know, categories, and then search, and boom, you can come, you can see them all at once. So you don't have to go search city by city by city by city. It's really time consuming to do that. Okay. Also, you can get an automated search software that will, you can program in keywords and it'll search continuously in the same thing and then when it finds a match, it grabs it and emails it to you. I have a software that does that, it's fantastic. It just runs all the time, it's in the cloud and when it finds a hit, it grabs it. it searches for other stuff too, you know, I'm looking for an email on Craigslist, but. <laughs> uh, call, don't email. First of all, Craigslist email delivery sucks. If you reply by email, Eight times out of ten, they don't even get it. Call. If you click on it to reply, usually there's a phone number of the person. If there's not, you, you, know, you have to email them. But most people put their phone number in there. Pick up the phone and call them. Don't text them. Call them. People like to be standoffish with him. Text me. Email me. But there, there's this. I mean, people do business with people who are like them and who they like. And if you can create that rapport with a seller or a buyer or a partner or a lender, you know, it really enhances your business. So um, don't email them, call them. And what's the purpose of the call? Get a meeting. To get a meeting. To get a meeting. Okay. So the email is to say, when can I call you? Tuesday or Thursday, four or six. Get them on the phone. When can we meet? Because you can't, you can't close a deal over text. I've never closed a deal by going, hey, I'll offer you. I'll, I'll, 105, 102, oh, deal. I've never done that over a text or an email. It's always over the phone or in person. Okay, so you gotta get into that, you know, connection thing with people. Look in the lesser known sections. You know there's a commercial section in, in Craigslist? Most people don't even realize it says commercial and office. I've seen self-storage facilities, apartments, car washes, all kinds of good stuff in there. And you search Tempest so you can search nationwide through the commercial. It's a very, very good tool. Most people don't even know that exists. Uh, real estate services. There's a couple little like sub things. And there's housing question. There's a couple little lesser known categories. Don't just look in the for sale by owner. Because the problem with for sale by owner is they're all idiots. You know that. You've all tried it. You call up a seller for sale by owner. They go, uh, what do you think it's worth? 300. What are you asking? 900. <laughs> Why do you think it's worth 900? Because I think it is. They're idiots. We'll deal with that in a little bit. <laughs> All right, so Craigslist is, uh, you know, creating, you know, finding leads, calling leads. Um, <clears throat> we'll talk about more specifically cold calling off of people off the list in just a moment, but this is what you're looking for on Craigslist, okay?